Hi, in this video, we're gonna take a look at managing contracts and ordering additional licenses on the VCPP Commerce portal. Let's click on contracts in the navigation menu to take a look at the active contracts for this cloud provider. Here I can see I have two contracts and one of them has a data center East tag associated with it. If I click the button, it'll filter my list of contracts and show the ones with the associated tag. Going into the contract, I can see my contract timeline and changes that have happened, basic information and contacts, plan information and contract size, and my associated tags. I can remove or add new tags to any of my contracts, and those tags will appear on the contract list. If I wanna look at related monthly billing orders, I can click view MBO list. Now up top, we have four tabs for managing the contract. Basic info, sites for logical separation of contracts, usage meter instances for automatic reporting, and one-off orders to request additional licenses. Let's go to sites and create the first site. Now to create a site, I need to give a site name, a country or region, and a postal code. Sites are a logical separation of a contract and reporting will then be done on a per site basis. This is especially useful for partners who have global contracts operating in multiple countries. Usage meter instances gives us the ability to add our usage meter into the commerce portal to be used for automatic reporting. Next, let's go to one-off orders and ask for additional licenses for our contract. Each contract size also has a specific number of licenses for each of the products that are provided. The one-off order form allows a partner to ask for additional licenses above and beyond what comes with the contract. Once you add a description, choose the products that you need additional licenses for, add a quantity, and then submit for approval. If you need any additional help with your contracts, check out our video on how to open a support ticket.